Hello everybody, Abolitionist Jay here with today's vlog. It is currently about quarter after seven on July 16th, 2018. Murder Dog and I are sitting at Wantoa Park because, well, we're unfortunately back on Long Island. Uh, <laughs> uh, since we recorded yesterday, Murder Dog and I uh, finished clearing our stuff up and heading out of the Moshannon State Forest finally found a garbage can or a dumpster where we could get rid of our large pile of crap and uh headed our, headed on home uh it was kind of a longer drive than i had hoped traffic uh through pennsylvania was a pain in the ass and of course once we reached new york well more traffic uh but we finally made it back close to uh close clo close to our former home and you know the girls still weren't feeling good very well uh, feeling very well last night so we weren't going to get to see them so we immediately went to the murder dog and i immediately went to the laundromat and began washing all of the clothes that we had that had been covered with dust uh during the uh our mishap on the way into the forest on friday <laughs> so between you know between all the clothes that hang up behind me and uh, the clothes i was wearing over the weekend and her blanket you know had to get all that washed, so that took us a while. You know, had to make sure all oh, that was washed and dried. And then once that was done, we actually headed off to our uh, our favorite cal stealth camping spot, which may actually not be uh, our favorite anymore. I don't know. There, I don't know if people are trying to push us out, or it just ha just so happens that the uh, tractor trailers that are sometimes parked on that road just keep happening to move further and further down the block. But anyway, we uh, we hung out there last night and uh watched a movie and whatnot and uh woke up this morning it was pretty hot already that was no fun uh had, had to get moving kind of early because it was already getting warm uh unfortunately the the kids still weren't feeling well today so we didn't get a chance to see them so murder dog and i just set off on our way we went and got uh went to the dog park we actually came down here to the dog park early on and then uh after about an hour or so here headed back up went and got my shower once we realized we weren't going to see the girls, we kind of drove around for a little bit, and then uh, we actually ended up uh, talking to uh, Michael W. Dean, and who asked if we, if I wanted to record a Freedom Fiends episode today. So we said, "Why the heck not?" So we went to try to find the best Wi-Fi we could and uh, sat down to to record an episode. We were actually recording for I don't know, it seemed like hours, but had a bunch of connection issues. Uh, luckily murder dog was all right in the back for most of that. Uh, as soon as we were done though, the temperature seemed to crank up even more. So finally had to turn the AC on and we just kind of hung out in the AC for a little while until, uh, it finally started to cool down. And then we headed back to the, uh, to the dog park to, uh, get her back out for about an hour or so. And now we're back in the car, just gave her her dinner with uh, a load of new medications because that's the other thing we did today actually had to take her to the vet because well she worried me a little bit during the trip uh she had been having some issues going to the bathroom and uh, i just wanted to make sure she was uh, okay doctor gave us a whole bunch of different meds for like inflammation and um a steroid you know one of those cure-all steroids prednisone that they give to every animal and human for like every condition imaginable um and some digestive stuff too although it appears that uh just the doctor checking her out and clearing out her uh stinky little anal glands seems to have hopefully solved the problem because the next time she went to the bathroom she was perfectly fine so just gonna keep an eye on it you know as i've said before i i usually uh Actually, it's not even usually. I, I always spend more money on her health than I do my own. Uh, I said that earlier to Michael Deans. He, he said, obviously, he's like, I'm glad he didn't say the kids. I'm like, well, yes, obviously the kids come first. But she comes a close second and definitely before me. I, I usually spend a hell of a lot more money on her health care than I ever would mine. So got to make sure my co-pilot's all right. She's, uh, I don't know, you can barely see her back there. She's lying down again now. But I think she had a good time this weekend. I had a good time. And, uh, you know, like I said yesterday, definitely, uh, definitely want to do that again, hopefully with the kids next time. Uh, but either way, you know, it was good to get away. It was good to, uh, be disconnected from the internet for a couple of days. You know, it was, a uh, it was inconvenient at first, but after the first few hours, I didn't even really think about it that much. And it was quite nice to not be constantly looking down at my phone and scrolling news feeds and stuff like that. So, but here we are back to reality. Like I said, kind of a bummer. I didn't get to see the kids again today. We could have ended up staying another day in Pennsylvania, but you know, whatever. Got tomorrow morning. We got that uh, doctor's appointment that had to be canceled the day that we left because my, my daughter was ill. Uh, since she's starting to feel better now, they rescheduled it for tomorrow. So 
I will get to see them tomorrow morning for that. Hopefully, I don't think it's supposed to be as hot because, like I said, today it was pretty brutal for about four or five hours. It, I think it said it only got up to 90, but the humidity was like 100%. The sun was beating down, so it felt even hotter than that. I think that was supposed to be the hottest day. It's supposed to get a little cooler. May actually get some rain, which would be nice. The uh, The element could definitely do use a washing on the outside. And, well, I don't have all my car wash stuff with me. And I'd really rather not pay to have the car washed, especially because I can't really have them touch the inside since there's, you know, so much crap here. <laughs> so, you know, a good, a good natural washing would be nice to get rid of uh, the bulk of the dust we collected while in PA. But... Anyway, that's uh, that's about it. You know, like I said, it's Monday the 16th, so that means a week from today I am back in court, allegedly for the beginning of my trial. Still waiting to hear from my lawyer. Uh, I think we're supposed to go over some things before I actually walk into the courtroom, so hopefully that'll happen in the next couple of days. But other than that, uh, you know, I'm just uh, killing time, hopefully going to see the kids as soon as possible, and then, you know, come next week I'll finally hopefully have a resolution of this whole thing one way or the other, and then I can start planning things uh out in more detail going forward because right now we're just kind of flying by the seat of our pants but anyway with that i think i will sign off thank you everybody as always for watching and this has been abolitionist jay and now that i'm back in new york we should be back to the dailies so uh this is actually i'm gonna post this today so this will be the second one uh, that goes up today but that'll put us back on track for dailies starting tomorrow so once again thank you everybody and uh i'll catch you next time peace y'all